So uh, is there anything uh, is there anything new that uh, you're working on with Jubelish or uh, um, I am I'm right now like uh, taking taking a little break. Um, oh okay. You know, figure out exactly who we are, um, and in the meantime, I'm working on a couple other projects. Uh, I just I took on a couple music videos. Oh okay. Uh, I have fun with that. I'm working on uh, uh, one with Shweki and a couple other people. Oh. Uh, so. so I want to ask you about uh, when when a Talk Yiddish to Me came out, and uh, there was yeah. now now there's like it's one of the top viewed videos on that channel. What? How did it? How did it feel when when there was so many uh, so much attention to that new video? Um, I was kind of surprised with with YouTube videos. It's it, it's always a surprise. The, the ones that you think are the best get the, the, the min, minimum amount of views. You're like, this thing's gonna go viral, and then it uh, you know yeah. great people watch it. Um, and then the talk Yiddish to me, I, I thought it was a I thought it was a good idea, and but I thought it was it was a good idea for a tweet. Yeah. So I tweeted it, and then like, and then like two people favorited the tweet, and I'm like, no, you don't get it. It's funny. <laughs> I thought, okay, maybe you know, they don't get it in a tweet. So I decided to just make a music video, <laughs> and uh, and I honestly didn't think uh, I honestly didn't think it would be, you know, that we you know would would get. That much traction, but uh, people like it. Came out into my noise. They like the Yiddish. Yeah. <laughs> so I go. So I, they were having a, cla a Yiddish class last year, and the first thing that my that the teacher showed us is that video, the talk Yiddish to me video. And I I saw it yeah. from before, and I and I when I saw it was like wow. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah. You made my day. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. And, and I think he still shows it to people. I the teacher. I think he still shows it. That's awesome. Yeah. Yes, it's it's crazy like we're you know, the videos make their way. Yeah. It's incredible. like I like I first I when I was coming up with this idea, I wasn't sure like I was thinking maybe I can get Mendy Pellet on. But, like, I thought maybe I would first have to become famous in order to get you on. But, like, well, I guess you don't have to be, like, a big person in order to... No, no, no. I, I, you know, I, um, when I first started, I wanted to get Montesio as a guest. And that's when Montesio was, like, he was, you know, on the top of his career, all yeah. over TV. You know, this, this one was at, at his peak. Yeah. And and then I was like, you know what? I don't think I'll be able to get him on the show, but I want to make myself uh, look bigger than I am. So I like kind of like what you did with Donald Trump. Yeah. I did. I decided I made like a fake interview. With, oh yeah, I uh, saw that. I, yeah, I made a fake interview with him, and and every once in a while I would say, my good friend Montesia, Montesia, you know. <laughs> Like, I'd make it as if, like, yeah, we're good friends, and, you know. Uh, um, and then I was at a culture grocery, and this lady came over to me and was like, uh, are you Mindy Pellin? I'm like, yeah. She's like, oh, my gosh, uh, my husband loves your videos. I'm like, oh, very nice. Well, uh, thank you. Thank you. What's his name? It's like, Matisio. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, he's like he's actually in the car. He would he would go crazy if he saw you. I'm like, uh, really? Okay. <laughs> and uh, I thought he would actually be offended by, by like making fun of him in that interview. Um, but uh, yeah, so then I he got in the car and and we became friends. You know, we went over to his house a lot and different stuff, and then we actually made videos together. So like. Uh, how how is Matisio? Is he a, like a 
like m- not many people know how he he is so like how you you know him a little bit so how is he like in person he's a he's a good soul you know he's a good good soul he's okay. just uh trying to he's on a journey you know he's, yeah uh, one what stops was Grand heights and he's he's continuing the journey but he's uh he's definitely a really sweet good man you know yeah 